okay, and feel ready to start our learning. We're going to begin again, but I'll see how quickly we can say all the phonemes that we already know. And I'm sure you're going to get quicker every day. Let's see if you are. You ready? Let's go. Wow, that was quick. Well done, everybody. But we must remember our new one, too. Because we now know another one, don't we? And the phoneme. Well done. And I think Miss Evans has got some words for us to practice our phoneme. Let's see what she's got for us today. I do. Put them up here. So let's see if we can read some of these words at the top first. Do you say your phonemes first? Put them together. Shall we do that one together? Mm. A. Mm. Van. Well done. The next word. Good job. And the last word. Put them sounds together. What word does that say? Shall we do it together? Mm. A. T. Vat. Well done. Now we're going to read a sentence with this sound in it as well. So when I... Let's do our phonemes for this sentence. Now, the first word, you don't need your phonemes for that. That's just one word that we have to remember. That's one of our tricky words. As you can see, it ends in a full stop as well. So that means that our sentence is finished. So let's do that all together. The, m, a, m, van, i, s, is, r, e, d, red. Should we read it all together first? The van is red. Good reading, everybody. Well done. So today your challenge is to write this sentence. If you ask your grown-ups to tell you the words in the sentence and see if you can have a go at writing it. Do you think you can do that? And if you would like, you can even draw a picture of a red van. To go with your sentence. Can't wait to see it. Can you, Mrs. Godwin? I can't wait. Well done, everybody. Shall we say goodbye again until tomorrow? Bye. Bye.